Hey guys, Achi Luxury. Hey guys, it's Achi. And um, guys, I just listed the entire Patek Philippe collection for sale. What do you think? What do you think? I've listed it. I've done it, guys. And I gotta tell you, man, I'm selling it as one entire collection. I don't want to piecemeal. I don't want to break it up. I don't want to sell some asshole just the books. You buy the whole thing or you fuck off. It's pretty simple, really, isn't it, hey? It's my collection. I do whatever I like. You understand? I do whatever I like. Um, this is how it goes. This is exactly how it goes, guys. And I'm afraid to tell you, man, it's simple. It's simple. You buy the lot or you don't buy anything. So, um, yeah, I don't want to, I don't want to break it up, piecemeal it out. No, you want the paddock collection, you buy the whole lot. Uh, so that there you go. Uh, 155,000, 100 US, just 100,000 US smackaroonies. Smackaroonies, good value. Good value. Uh, so there you go. Soap on a rope, guys. Soap on a rope. That's right, guys. Soap on a rope. Uh, yeah, that's how it goes. Soap on a rope. Thank you, Dan Tillman. Thank you. 100 smacker Roonies. <coughs> yeah. Yeah, there you go, guys. That's a entire collection. That's the best of. That's everything. I, I put my life into that that piece there. I've just sent the invite out to the treacherous snakes. The treacherous snakes have been invited on. Um, I, I honestly, I, I don't know. I, 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 I set the terms. I'm the seller. Okay, I'm the seller. I decide. What happens to my collection? Uh, it's all, all the watches are in the bank safe, except for I've got my 5127 and uh, my 5196. That's it. Yeah, there you go, guys. What do you reckon, hey? Is that cool or what? So, I don't want to break it up. I want to sell it as one big, co a complete collection. 155 Aussie smackaroonies, and I'm going to go into buying the cheapest Porsche, cheapest Rolls Royce, cheapest Ferrari, like Hoovy. Hoovy's Garage. You know Hoovy? Blue Shirt Buddha, hello. 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 Uh, what's happened there? Our Super Chat button isn't working. Is something wrong, boys? Hmm. Five identical Patex. Yes. And I could sell it and buy a 50. Oh, thank God. Yen XX. Two euro. Hi, Arch. How's it going? Depression kicking in there? Yeah, I'm out of my mind. I'm out of my mind. I'm out of my mind. Of course. Why would someone say sell a beautiful life's work paddock collection like that? Why would you do that? You wouldn't, would you? Um, how is my friend Loudmouth? I hope you've got a job, Loudmouth, Tim. I hope he gets back in the saddle. Keep the 6006. Am I getting out of the watch? I don't know. No idea. No commitments. Except at gunpoint. I'm still going to have... My, I might go into collecting Jago Lecoultres. I might go into Lange. I might go... number of things I could buy. Number of 
No, I don't want to sell watches. I hate dealing with customers. Okay. The Gazillion Air. The Gazillion Air. Hello, poor people. Two dollars. The Gazillion Air. Thank you. The Gazillion Air. I don't want to be in the watch business because I hate customers. Okay. I, I hate dealing with customers. They really fuck me off. I hate customer service. Okay. Yankee Doodle, two dollars. Why don't you transition back to Rolex? Why cars? I think it's because I've been starved of cars. I want to buy a Miata. Okay, I want to buy a Miata for the channel. I mean, Doug DeMiro's done the Ferrari. He's done the G240. He's done all these Aston Martin. Well, I'm going to start at the arse end. Yeah, you schmooze, you lose, Richard Sos. Uh, look, guys, I don't know. I mean, it's a life's work. That is all I own. That watch collection is it. That is me. That's my super. That's my future. Car fun. Car fun. Two dollars. Excited for the new content and unboxings to come. Thank you very, very much. So, guys, I don't know what to say. I don't want to break it up. I don't want to sell. Someone said, oh, can you sell this brochure? No, 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 no. You buy the whole lot or you buy nothing. Simple. Howdy from Texas. Two dollars. How to sub to the real pontiff, a.k.a. Zane the winner. Wah, 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 wah. Yankee Doodle. Two dollars. Buy one cool car and a few Rolex. That's the play. Possibly. I have no idea. I have no idea at this stage. I could go Vacheron. It's another brand I really do love there. And G, and G, two dollars. Art, sell per text and buy a Saxonia Thin or a 5196P. I'd probably be over with Paddock if I sold it all out. I probably just would never come back to the brand. Okay. Holy fuck, saw a new vet today. A new vet today. Um, yeah, the Hertz is selling the Z06s, which apparently is not as good as the Z07, but the Z06 you can get from Hertz, low kilometers, under 60,000 US dollars. That's for a super, 650 horsepower supercar. Okay, guys, Aunt G. I love you, Aunt. I love you, Aunt G. Aunt G is, these are my Aldi, Aldi headache tablets. Hey, Tan the Man, $5. AC3 Vacheron, are you kidding me? Tell those punters the story of how on the Vacheron Lounge Forum, when you talked about a new movement, they, they shunned you. Yes, yes, the Society for Thin Dress Watches. I wasn't taken seriously. I actually did love the Hour Lounge. That's the Vacheron, the Vacheron Forum, the Hour Lounge. I think I might have been, I don't know if I was kicked out of that. They're very polite guys at Vacheron. Um, yeah, so, so that's, that's, oh my God, what the hell's happened here? My God, what's going on? Neil, two pounds. How can you fall out of love with Paddock so quickly? And RCO, Arch, RCO, 100 smackaroonies. Arch, I missed a week of, or two, and now I see you're blowing it up. Sell the Patex, then buy a real fuck off Paddock, Perpetual or Chrono. This should make up for the Miss Super Chats the last couple of weeks. Thank you, man. Thank you, RCO. I've just been down a bit. I've been a bit down. I'll be honest with you. The kids I've got, the eldest kids, absolutely terrible lifestyle choices. Let's just say that. Terrible lifestyle choices. And then we've got... Uh, I, I had a bit of a flare up the other day, Zane. It's put me off the brand. Put me off. I can't afford a celestial. Uh, <clears throat> but uh, I got to be totally honest with you. It's um, yeah. This is what happens. I've, I've just I've, I've I want to sell the collection as one bang gone. 
one collector, get everything. I mean, the collection, it, it's my life's collecting work there in Paddock. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll see how it goes. RCO, thank you. Thank you so much. Um, RCO, it means a lot to me. That helps me a lot. I've uh, I've had some personal problems lately. The kids, fuck me dead. The kids, Zane came in. I tell you what's wrong. In psychology, you have certain areas of your life, okay? So we've got one area here, which is the relationship with my children, the oldest two children. They're fucking, don't listen to me. They live a, a lifestyle choice that I don't particularly approve of. Okay, that's that. We've got my career. My career. It's in the toilet. YouTube's fucked. The figures are down. Uh, IT career is super fucked. Then we've got my love life. Fucked. Every facet of my life is not going so well. And that's what happened there. That is exactly what happened. So, um, yeah, I just feeling a bit... That's and Then Zane came along. And normally I can handle abuse... But um, I gotta be honest with you, it was a bad timing, and I, I just, it was bad timing. It just, just got me at a bad period. Okay, I'm at a low. I'm at a really low point in my life. Golden batter, two dollars. Zane the brain, best paid heel in the game. Yes. So. Yeah, it's um. It's uh, it's how it's how it goes, man. But anyhow, rooted rota, rooted rota. Um, it's just how it goes. You try your best. That's all any of us can do in life. That's it. That's all we can do is try our best and move forward. I'd like to sell it as one lot. I don't want to fuck around piecemealing this, that, that. Oh, fuck. I hate that. I want to sell the lot, give you everything, and fucking get out of the mark. That's what that's what I'd like to do. I really would like to get completely out of the mark, and that's kind of the way I see it. RCO fifty dollars. Oh my God! Look at this. This is it. RCO fifty bucks. Um. RCO says, honestly, you should sell some of the patetic Patex. Just save one and get back to basics. Rolex speedies. When I got my second Patek, I stopped wearing everything else. Had to force myself to put them in the safe. Now I'm happily wearing my speedy again. Actually, you know something, RCO? I think you may have a good point there. You may have a good point. Yeah, you may have a good point. Hmm. Very interesting. That may be a very good point how to go there. Yes. Interesting. Very, very interesting indeed there. Um, yeah, I, I, I tend to agree. I just don't... I. I think you got a very good point, RCO. Car fun, five bucks. When are you, when are you going to stop letting these punters and snakes abuse you and fight back? AC3, I know the AC3 I know would set them in their place. Good point, car fun. Yankee Doodle, two dollars. Everybody is home watching YouTube. How's it down? Because the advertising is down. Hertz is in advertising. They're on the bones of their ass in bankruptcy. The airlines aren't advertising. Super Chats are up a little bit, but the advertising revenue is 30, 40, 50% down. Okay, that's that's that that's reality. Stu Jumbo, five pounds. What do you think of the Panerai Luminar 40 mil? P.S. You are the coolest guy on YouTube. 40 mil's too small. Too small, too small, too small. Panerai is 44 mils. Okay, I'm just telling you, anything small is going to be hard to sell. It's going to be very, very, very hard to sell. 
Malik Diamond, twenty dollars. I don't care for any any many chronograph. Can you check out a Breitling A four two o three five on Chrono? Cheap vintage. Look, let's get that baby up there. Chrono twenty four. Let's get this baby up now. I got to tell you, uh, the fact it's got an A movement is not a good thing. Okay. A, what's the number there, guys? You've got to get this number. 42035. 42035. Okie dokie. So, i got to be totally honest with you. This is just an ETA uh, piece. It's not really anything special. Uh, do I like it? Uh, uh, it's cheap. It's cheap uh two thousand bucks it's very cheap look for two thousand bucks it, it it i'd rather buy a brightling than a a tag hoyer or a um yeah yeah it's it's look it's cheap but it's it it's it's yeah no it's 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 a cheap look it's it's okay it's okay the look brightling is 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 very for, for that money it's okay rooted rotor two dollars a fancy wancy a nice fancy wancy bluze will perk up the pontiff. I'd probably go ceramic. Yeah, I think you're right there. Just getting back to this super chat here, which was a fortune. RCO. Honestly, sell some of your paddocks. Just save one. Ooh, maybe the 6006 or the world time. Oh, probably the world time's too much money. Sell it, sell it, sell it. And get back to basics. Rolex, speedies. When I got my second paddock, I stopped wearing everything else. Had to force myself to put them in the safe. Now I'm happily wearing my Speedy again. Mm. You know, I've been lusting for a Speedy. You know that? I've really been lusting for a Speedy. A Speedy. Yeah. Yeah. I think he's got a good point there. Hey, Vintenier. How are you, man? Blue Shirt Buddha, special hello to Blue Shirt Buddha. Keep the 5127. It's a sleeper. You know what? I could sell my whole collection and buy buy that one I'm selling. Because it hasn't got papers, so it's a bit cheaper. Um, yeah. Yeah. That's exactly it. What do you reckon, guys? I don't know what to say. The Tingler. Rooted Rotor, the Tingler, the Tingler. So um, anyhow, guys, it's it's an interesting quandrum. Interesting quandrum. What would you do? What can you do? Rooted Rotor's got advice there. Keep the five. I'm wearing the five one two seven today. I really do love that piece. I really do love that piece. It's a beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. It is very, very beautiful. And I got to tell you something, guys. A lot of people say to me, how, you know, you're selling, maybe it's the same 5127 you're selling. No, it's not. I'll show you how I can prove it to you. Look at this. I'll show you how I can prove it to you. Look at this. See, this is the one I, that's mine. And I don't know if you noticed this, but it has it has the three dots it's not got the dots at the date do you see that it's got the space at the date the one i'm selling has got the the dots so that's how you can tell that i'm actually they're two different watches different dial completely different dial Tan Zeal, five dollars. Are you selling your Patek collection to become a tint watches collector? Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I've had a few personal problems at the moment, but we will see. Definitely see. And yes, that's exactly it. Definitely see. That's the way it's going. Pluto. Oh, come on, pharmacist. Come on, man. It's all cool. Be cool. 
Uh, how many tape watches can you buy for one paddock? Good question. So that's that's my one. And let me find the 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 other one I have got there. How did I do that? Yeah, that's it's it's amazing. Oh, that's March. Okay. So I I just wanted to tell you guys, uh, it's very important to me. And I'll just call up the other one. The other one, I want to show this to you. So that's my one. Notice the dots. There's no, it's 57 dots around. So now I'm going to stop that one. And I'm going to share another page. Here we go. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. And you can see it's got the dots at the side there. Because this one's a little bit newer. It's also got the 324 movement and not the 315. So, guys, I got to tell you, Tad Zeal, <coughs> the man, Zeal got me in and the Zane got me out. In with the Zeal, out with the Zane. In with the Zeal, out with the Zane. Yes, what do you think? What do you think indeed? That is the question. That is the question, guys. Frederick from Sweden. Sell all Pedex, buy a cool car, and buy a sub bluesy. Every man needs a Rolex. I love my bluesy. Yep, I, I agree with you. Tanzeal, $5. AC3, I believe Adrikos had a Nautilus with dots running with dots around the dial. Is your Patek also a prototype? No, that's just the two clear versions. There's two, if you if you look on the paddock forums, there's two. The early 5127s and the later 5127s. There's actually a number of variations. There's one that's rhodium plated. There's one that's not rhodium plated in the white gold. There's 324 movement. There's 315 movement. There's a number of variations. So that's the way it goes, guys. That is the way it goes. And I love, I love the Grand Classique from Patek Philippe. That's what I do. I do love my Grand Classiques. I love them. I love Classiques from the Philippes. The Philippes. The Patek Philippes. I love them. I love them to death. Yeah, I do. And uh, what can you say? I love, I love collecting watches. They've, they've given me a lot of pleasure. I'd like to get a Miata. I want to buy a third or fourth hand Miata. I'd love to buy a third or fourth hand Miata. And uh, yeah, that's it. A Miata. Mata, Mata. Mata, Mata, Mayata, Mata, Mata, I wanna Mata, 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 Mazda, Mazda, Miata. That's what I wanna get, Miata. Here we go, Ted Zeal, five bucks. A bunch of punters are asking you to revive the Archie 5 with a number of Rolex. But those that remember the Archie 5 that you purposely kept Rolex out, yes. Yes, I did. That was a interesting collection. Yeah! Yeah, guys. Yeah. Yeah, that's an interesting... i got to be honest with you. Let's be totally honest here, okay? Yankee Doodle. Yankee Doodle. You're a man of many contradictions. i got to tell you, to be... Let's be completely honest here. Don't get so upset. Let's just calm the fuck... Let's back the truck up. Beep, 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 beep. Tanzeal, remember this. I'm selling it as one collection. That's not going to sell. Come on, man. It's just a very cool way for me to get out of selling anything. It gives me face and content for YouTube. You know what I mean? What about if I sold it for 155000 
and possibly got a 5970. Would that keep you happy? A man and he's 5970. Mm, very, very interesting. Tanzeal, the man. Very interesting indeed. Tanzeal, five bucks. AC3, can you tell the live stream about the Archie 5? Many don't know what it was. What was your philosophy making that? collection yes that was this was back in the day this was back in the day i was a youngster i was only new in the youtube celebrity game and what i decided to do was i decided to build a watch collection a watch collection that no other youtuber had i wanted to build some great stuff that's exactly it, man. I wanted to build some great stuff for the punters. So what I did was I built the Archie 5. Now, many people have speculated what was in the Archie 5. Let's bring up the Archie 5. These were the five wristwatches I owned. The Archie 5. Look at this here. So what did I have exactly? What did I have? Paddock 5-1. Rooted, 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 rooted. $2 thoughts on the 16.753 root beer. Bluesy better? Ah, they're both cool. Both cool? I prefer a bluesy because the bitches like blue. It goes with my blue balls. The Archie 5, so we had the 5107, which was just the quintessential. I actually prefer it to the 5127. I think the 5107 was the best. I had the 5035. That is the same 5035 I have today. I had my Reverso Grand Date. Um, and that is the Reverso Grand Date. I had the Breguet, Breguet Type 20, and I had a Royal Oak 14790 ST, that was my Royal Oak, so it was a very, I loved that collection, I really loved that collection, that was the Archie 5! And it's kind of sad. It that was the Archie Five. It had a chronograph. Had a didn't have a GMT. It had a World Time. Sorry, an annual calendar. I had dress watches. I had a lot of genres. No divers. Uh, no diver. And there was um, yeah, no diver. No diver at all. Um, what do I say? The Archie 5. This was it. <clears throat> this was the Archie 5. And they were cool. They were. That was my five wristwatches. Five wristwatches. Yeah. There you go. Yankee Doodle, $2. What's the worst thing your Reverso witnessed? Selling off the Archie 5. Yeah, if only it could talk. Yeah, I look at this photo here for hours. I can look at this photo here for hours. This was the Archie 5. Perfectly balanced. Just a beautiful collection i don't know why i'm not happy anymore i don't know why this collection made me so happy yet i seem to be unhappy miserable i don't know about miserable is the right word i got so i got, got some personal issues 
the eldest two kids weren't absolute fucking assholes at this stage when I owned this collection. They were kind of semi-manageable. Semi-manageable? Yes. Well, yes, yeah, semi-manageable. So, uh, I don't know what to say. I do not know what to say. It's, it's, um, yeah, that's the Archie 5 Stew Dumbo 5 Euro. About what selling? Why not just buying good deals and reviewing them on YouTube? An employee could sell them and doing customer service. Uh, I don't want fucking staff. Jesus Christ. <laughs> you know what the minimum wage here is in Australia? It's more than I earn. I'd be paying the guy more than I earn. I don't want employees and... Oh, Jesus Christ, that's a disaster. I'm looking at moving overseas once my youngest is 18. I'd like to get the fuck out of Dodge. Get the fuck out of Oz. Yeah, that's what I'd like to do. So... I don't know what to say, man. It's just how it goes. The Archie... Something about this picture that just... It was a different time. It was a different time. Um, yeah, I love that collection. You know, I could look at this photo for hours. <clears throat> Hours just staring into space. The Archie 5, never to be repeated again. My God, what happened? What went wrong? Tanzil, $5. Which of the following gave you a third asshole? AP Royal Oak Service? The second flight to Singers to fix the rooted rotor? Fixing the dented Patek or Zane? Ooh. Oh, I would say, fuck, man. You really know how to, the low points, the AP Royal Oak Service, that was about three and a half Aussie. Fuck. Second flight to Singers. Uh, that wasn't too bad. I was going anyhow. Uh, fixing the dented... Pa Actually, that, that, that watch tech, Ronnie at Vintage Watch Co. Watch Tech took care of that. Did an amazing job. Or oh, Zane. Zany Poo! Hello, Zany Poo! Zany Poo! Zany Poo? Uh, <clears throat> Zany Poo. Yeah. I don't know what to say, guys. It was a amazing time. You know, sometimes I look back on previous collections and I don't understand why it didn't bring me happiness. Why didn't it make me that happy at the time I sold them if I could go back? If I could go back. If I could go back, I'd like to go back, fucker Roonies. I would like to go back in my life. I would, I would, I would, I would. I love Patek Philippe. I love living the life. I want to live a good life, a good, honest life. That's what I want to do. Yeah, I tell you what, guys, it's been... It's been a really good fun. You know, I do love the shows. I do love... I must admit, these shows are so cool. Uh, I want to thank you for coming here. I really do. Yankee Doodle, $2. Which three watches do you regret selling, trading the most? Here's what I found on the web. Hey, fuck off, Google. <laughs> Goodbye, Google. Fucking hell. Ah, uh, which three do I regret selling? I probably regret selling my Maserati Blue Daytona. I regret selling the V serial number Bluesy.
and my 1016. I should never have sold my fucking 1016 I had, that's for sure. You know, it's sort of, um, yeah, you sort of, you sort of just go down a, a weird path, but, um, yeah, I kind of, I kind of went down a weird road, guys. Mazda Miata, what do you think? You know how expensive vets are in Oz. They are so damn expensive. Yankee Doodle. Yankee Doodle. Dave! Dave! Can I buy back the Daytona? Dave! No, I don't think I can. I can't do that. It's no longer... Um, very good. It's no longer very good. Um, yeah, I gotta be honest with you. It has been a difficult life. I've tried my best, and you know, it's 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 good. I, look, I gotta tell you, I got some great, great fans here. I love, I just looking at this picture, I could look at this for hours. The memories I had. I was younger, slimmer. The Archie Five. Mmm. Amazing. Amazing. Extravaganza weekend. Yeah, it's kind of sad. It is sad. You know, I, I I did enjoy my whist watches, whist watches. I loved my whist watches. I did. I loved them so much. You have no idea how much I loved my watches, my whist watches. And uh, it's kind of sad. Very sad there. Jeb, five dollars. Hair a fiver. Hey, Jeb, thank you, thank you so much. There, it's been a good show. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you. This was a, a really nice show. Um, I want to say thank you so much. Thank you for coming, and I'll be back tomorrow. Look, the way I look at it is, I'll be honest with you, okay. If I can sell the collection as a piecemeal, I'd start again. It's in the hands of the gods. I don't want to break it up. I don't want to hack off a bit. Sell the whole fucking thing. Sell the whole fucking thing. Yankee Doodle. Two dollars. There's something very romantic about that breaker. Yes, indeed. It was a beautiful breakster. It was beautiful. Absolutely love that watch. The Brega. The Bregster. The Brega. Yes, sir. The Brega. Beautiful watch. Absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Beautiful watch, that Brega. It was very, very beautiful. And uh, look, look, it's this is how the worm turns. The worm turns. So uh, what do you say? Thomas G, two pounds. Don't focus on what others do. You are the pontiff. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Guys, I want to thank you for tuning in. I'll be back tomorrow. Thank you so much for the super chats. That means a lot to me. Jaden V, better show without Mark, Clive, etc. Ah, oh, no, they're, they're cool. They're cool. They're cool. 
Look, you you different. You want different start. You don't want just the same stuff rehashed every time. You got to have do something a bit different. And they're, 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 they're okay. They are okay. They're okay. You know, they are okay. So, you know, it, it it's it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. So I, I I don't mind that. I don't. I do not mind that one bit. I don't mind that one bit. You know. So, um. It's cool. It's very cool. Um, so, guys, that's that's the way life goes. The Archie Five. I can never forget that. That that meant so much. The Archie. I mean, looking back on it, you could say, "Oh, the AP was a bit small." The Da, da 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 but as a collection it just had mass it had mass it had mass and um yeah yeah uh yeah yeah that's exactly that's the way it is um, it's tough. It's a very tough world. I love you. I love you so much. I love you. That's the the reality there. I love my audience. I love my fans. I love the the support. Tan Zeal, fuck me dead. That man. Um. I think I think that um. Tan Zeal. He's a fucking nice man. Lovely guy. Oh, he, he fucking rang me. Um, he's a cool guy. The Zeal is, is just a lovely guy. He's not a fucking new... He's, he's owned. He owned a 5711. He's owned Royal Oak. All the cool shit. And, and he loves traditional paddocks. And that's the thing, you know, you look at the hobby, um, this is the reality. Yankee Doodle, $2, we love you, brother, stay strong, thank you, Yankee Doodle, thank you, Yankee Doodle. It's, 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 it, look, it's, 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 it is good, there's some very good guys out there, got a couple of people contacted me, it's, it's all cool, it's all cool, don't worry, guys. It's all good. So, um, hey, thanks for coming on there. Yep. Hey! Hey, how are you, Rancher? Hey, this is Boris. No, that's, that's the Rancher, yeah. Yeah, what's going uh, on? Uh, you know, actually, um, I went and had, uh, I went and had, uh, I went and had dinner, I bought dinner for my daughter. Because, because my children love me. <laughs> Don't worry, you can have mine. Believe you me, i fucking, you know, uh, it's not about love. When they've chosen life, look, the problem is with these kids, let me tell you this. The difference they're, is... They're, they're all good, right, if, if you do what they say. As soon as you say, hey, this isn't working out right, hey, maybe you can't smoke fucking ice every fucking day of your life. Maybe putting satanic drawings on the wall in chalk is not a sensible thing when you got a when you got a, a house inspection next week. Probably. Maybe you should well, fix the fucking broken door that your fuckhead friends busted through because they were tr they thought you had ice in the other room. <laughs> maybe, well, maybe, maybe that could be a, a a really good idea. You know. Well, maybe maybe they're thinking if they played with the devil. You know the family curse with of, of horns won't be visited upon them. Yeah, so I got to be honest with you. These kids, yeah, they they are good for you when you do what they want. My son, when he's on drugs, he just turns into an absolute fucking cunt. He's he's actually both of the boys are actually really nice boys, but when they're on the gear, absolute fucking ten, assholes. Ten, fucking king assholes. Deal. 
Tanzeal, $5. Clyde, what are your thoughts on the Archie 5? And should Archie reboot the 5? Tudor Hydronaut, Tag, Hoya, Monaco, Shaitling, Fisto, and Spam Submariz. Uh, now that's the Archie 5 on there right now, right? Yeah, that's the 5, yes. Yes, siri. And other than two Patek Philippe's, it's actually well balanced. Yeah, no divers, but Clivers, no well, divers. I would, I, I would have uh, sell the calatrava. I mean, the only thing is maybe sell the calatrava, and then get a uh, submariner. Ah, yes, I understand. That's a, f mind you. Look, I got to be honest. If you don't get too upset there, um, I got to be honest with you, Clive. I got to be honest with you. Um, I probably won't sell it as a whole lot, would I? If I've lumped it together like that, will it sell? I just can't be bothered breaking it up and dealing with fifty fucking tire kickers. Well. What else do you no, I've got no hope of selling it as five pieces together, have I? Be honest with me. No. No. Not unless you, you could. You, you could have dragged it out a bit more. I, I could have, but then again, oh, I'm sorry. I got to tell you. I got to tell you. I got to be honest with you. I got to be honest with you. Can I be out? Can I be honest with you? I got to be frank and honest with you. I really, totally got to be frank and honest with you. What was I going to say? Yeah. Yeah. No. No. Uh, yeah, because if they you, you know what I'm, I'm gonna do. You know, I've decided, what? Clive. You've been an inspiration. Okay, Tanzeal has inspired me. Can I tell you what I'm gonna do with my life? What's that? Oh, sorry, Tanzeal, five dollars. Clyde, what are your thoughts on Archie selling his Patex to buy five identical Mazda Miatas? Now, before you answer that, I just want to tell you, I decided I wanted a Porsche. I love Porsche. You, you love Porsche too, don't you? Porsche. Porsche. I love Porsche. I love BMW. I love Mercedes-Benz. But you don't know the truth? Are you going to be honest with me? Yeah, I'm going to be totally be honest, honest with, with you. Me. They're you... fucking expensive! And they're unreliable, and they are hideously expensive to service and maintain. Right. Agree or you don't agree? Tell me the truth. I agree. They're trouble. They're fucking trouble, okay? Agree, Plastic Archie, Archie, water Archie, pump. Archie, Archie, Archie. Plastic water pump. Archie, Archie, Archie. Plastic Archie. this. Look at Scotty Kilmer, okay? Yeah. Okay? Not to mention Hoopty. Yeah, you you don't want to be Australia's answer to Hoopty. Actually, do you know how much money he makes? That guy is... Um, Chad Rad, $2. I always liked your Breguet Type 20. Thank you, Chad Rad. But you know what I'm going to do? I want to get a second hand, okay, a third or fourth hand Mazda Miata. Okay. I don't need to sell my whole when collection I, to pay for that. When I get into my, when I get into my MR2, mm -hmm. especially if the roof, if the roof's usually, if it's a decent day, the first thing I do is I take the roof off, take the yes. top down, then I get into the car. It's substantially easier. Yes. But even with the roof up. It is still much the. I don't think you'd fit in Miata. I used to have one. I bought a third hand one, a second hand one, many years ago. Are you the same as you were many years ago? <laughs> I like to think so. No. Well, I like to think so, Clive. Look, there's an idiot part of our brains that refuses to believe that we've, we've, we're, that, that refuses, to, I mean, that insists that we're still 18 years old. Okay. Now, that part of your brain is probably the predominant part of your brain. But you're not 18 years old anymore. Tanzeal, speaking of 18 year olds, Tanzeal, $5. 
70% of Porsches produced are still on the road. When Clive retired in 63, he was offered a Porsche as a gift from Matlock, but he chose a phony Flieger. <sighs> See, I don't know where he's getting that. I don't know where he's getting that from because I would think at least three out of ten Porsches are wrecked. Mm. Uh, okay. Here. Yankee Doodle, two dollars. John Canogan did a vid on a Porsche towing an A three eighty. Yeah, that that that, that, yes, that, but... that they are a look look. And Golden Batter, $2. Send Zane the link. We're getting off soon. We're getting off. I've got to go out this morning. But I, I just wanted to say, Clive, I think you nailed it. Get an inexpensive sports car and have fucking fun. What do you think? Well, the trouble is the inexpensive sports cars. I mean, the stuff that was dirt cheap. Yeah. Are going. You know, I picked like a, a, a first generation MR2. Is yeah, but they're, they're they're collectible, I, yeah. th But you don't go first generation because they're expensive. You, and, and and I don't think that's the best one anyhow. The one you've got that's the last generation, isn't it? Yeah, the Spider. On the other hand, do you know how much I in two thousand three? Do you know how much I picked up that first generation for? How much? Guess. Two thousand bucks. Nope. More or less. Less. Thousand bucks. Nope. Five hundred bucks. Close, six hundred. Okay, and what are they worth now? Damn sure worth more than that. I, I actually think even the uh, I think even the uh, I, the spiders were actually the least love of the group. They're they they did the least with them. They didn't put in special engines. They didn't put in turbochargers or superchargers. Or yeah, I don't want any of that garbage. I just want a, a nice little fun go kart. That's it. Well, and the thing people are starting to realize is that because of modern health and safety regulations, they can't build small little cheap cars like that anymore. What Even do you think of the idea? I'm going to go and get some finance. Okay. I'm going to go and no. finance it. What? No, you can't what? afford it. If you can't buy it, you can't afford it. Don't finance Clive. No. Why do you say that? Because you don't go into debt on a toy. If you can't afford to buy the toy, then you can't afford to buy the, buy the toy. Mm -hmm. Period. Okay. Mr. C, one dollar. And with that, we're going to wrap this baby up. Thank you so much. Love you all. See you.